Do you love animals? I love them. I love petting them, watching them on TV, and learning from them whenever I have the opportunity. The animal kingdom is extremely large, and there are many, many animals that seem very strange to us because we have not yet learned anything from them. Wildlife never stops surprising us and showing us strange animals that we have never had the pleasure of meeting. Lesser known animals can be the most wonderful, the most interesting, and the most special. Although the fact that they are rare also has to do with some of these animals being in danger of extinction. If you want to learn more about the animal kingdom, have fun discovering new species, and learn how you and I can help conserve these animals, come with me and discover the amazing animals you probably never heard of. And for some extra fun, find our mascot net hiding throughout the video. Oh, Capi! In ancient Egypt, there was an animal that attracted the attention of all foreigners, but its existence was not accepted or recognized by Western science until the last century. At first, they thought it was some kind of a zebra, but then discovered that its closest relationship was with the giraffe. The okapi draws a lot of attention for its zebra feet. It's a very strange combination of species. Like its family, the giraffe, the okapi is vegetarian and does not have any hostile behavior. Despite its small size, the okapi manages to be one of the largest animals in the rainforests of the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Drill Surely you know the famous mandrill, the largest monkey in the world, and one of the monkeys that are most often shown in animated films and documentaries. The mandrill is such an important specimen that it has even created its own genus in the animal kingdom, the genus Mandrillus, of which the less known but not less important cousin of the mandrill, the drill is part of. The drill lives in a small region of West Africa and has a very similar appearance to the mandrill, except for its face which is black instead of being colorful, and its chin which is red. These monkeys are omnivores, which means they can feed on anything they find, such as grass, plants, fruits, and small animals. Unfortunately, the drill is an endangered species because humans are hunting it for food, something really terrible. The Pygmy Hippo Hippos are truly fearsome creatures. They could devour you in one bite. But if you've ever seen a baby hippo, you should know that they are the most adorable animals that exist in the world. Can you imagine how wonderful it would be if these creatures stayed small forever? Well, the Pygmy Hippo is a species of hippo much smaller and cuter than the hippos we have seen in the zoo. These small animals were discovered in the 19th century and live in the rainforests and swamps of West Africa. Although they look like miniature hippos, pygmy hippos have some different habits than their giant counterparts, such as walking alone or in small groups and spending more time on land than in water. Rotilis Africa is full of innocent prey and wild predators. And there is one predatory species in particular that likes to hunt in groups, the hyenas. But can you imagine a hyena capable of feeding on small insects? The protilis is a very particular species of the hyena family. It does not usually catch large prey such as zebras. The protilis prefers to go for smaller prey. Its jaws and teeth are weak but its tongue is long and sticky, allowing it to eat its favorite dish, termites. Now, this does not mean they're friendly. If the protilis is in danger, it will be able to defend itself and keep its area free from other predators. They are very common in the southern and eastern parts of Africa. So remember that as friendly and smiling as they may sound, hyenas are still hostile animals. Fosa. In Madagascar, there is a carnivorous mammal, capable of climbing trees very easily. The fosa manages to maintain a high position in order to catch its prey, which is mostly lemurs and birds. The fosa may look similar to a house cat, but its size is almost twice that of our beloved kittens that walk around our home. 
It is an animal that manages to be active, both during the day and at night. In addition to having a mostly solitary life, although some have occasionally been seen with others hunting together. Unfortunately, their conservation status is vulnerable because people use them as pets only because they look similar to domestic cats. Lowland Stripped Tenrec Tenrecs are strange and cute mammals that are characterized by being very small and having long pointed snouts that they use for digging up and eating insects and worms from the ground. The lowland strip tenrec is part of this family and lives in the lowland rainforests of Madagascar. The fur of this tenrec is quite peculiar, black with yellow stripes and with spikes scattered all over the body. The most curious thing about this striped tenrec is the way it communicates with its friends, raising its quills and shaking them, or brushing its quills against each other to generate a sound similar to that of a cricket. If you would like to know what these strange little animals are talking about, you will not be very lucky, because the sound they produce cannot be perceived by the human ear. Gerials In northern India lives a curious species of crocodile that attracts a lot of attention. The gerials is a species of reptile that has an elongated snout, unlike other crocodiles. This particularity is due to the adaptation of the species to make it easier to hunt fish, which makes it almost impossible for it to be able to hunt large animals. Another function that its elongated snout has is the ability to make whistling noises, which are heard up to several blocks away and attract other gharials for reproduction. This large snout shrinks as the gharial ages. Its population has less than a thousand gharials, which makes this species critically endangered. White Lions In nature, there are lions whose fur is white as snow. These strange lions are not a myth. They are a reality that it's in danger of extinction, and that most of them do not live in the wild anymore. Wild lions, unlike albinos, can have black spots on their noses and ears, as well as having a special gene that gives them their white fur. A cub can only be born with this coat if both of his parents have the same gene. These animals are considered the most sacred by some Timbabati ethnic groups in southern Africa, such as the Sepeti and the Tsonga, but this could not save them from being hunted for fur and being taken into captivity for people's entertainment. The good news is that, today, there are some white lions in the wild in the Kruger National Park and in Timbabati, where no one will hunt them. Indian Flapshell Turtle In the Uttar Pradesh and West Bengal regions of India, there is a highly illegal traffic of wildlife, especially seven species. But one of them is the one that received the most damage. Almost 95% of the flapshell population is rescued from the East Asian meat and medicine markets. Flapshell turtles inhabit mostly fresh water such as streams, ponds, rivers, and swamps. The diet of this turtle is frogs, fish, aquatic vegetation, etc. Its dense and fleshy body is what catches the attention of hunters, who only see them as an exquisite and unique dish in a market. Sadly, the flap shell turtle population is declining, and its status is critical, and not even organizations have been able to protect this unique species. Mangalitsa guilt pig The Austrian Mangalitsa pig is a really strange animal. When have you seen a pig covered in wool or hair like a sheep? I will never have imagined that this type of animal existed in real life. The reason you and I didn't know this furry little pig is because in 1993, he was nearly extinct. Fortunately, a dedicated group of keepers and breeders took it upon themselves to bring the Mangalitsa species back to life, getting it used as livestock in Hungary and exported to places like North America and the UK. Thus, this pig began to be used in the manufacture of special hams and salamis because its meat and fat are more delicious, nutritious and durable than those of an average pig, although almost extinct. This strange species of pig turned out to be very important to humanity. Hammerhead Bat 
in practically every region of our planet, there is a very special mammal. In fact, the only mammal capable of flight. The bat is the second most diverse species after rodents, but we will talk about one species in particular, the hammerhead bat. Yes, it is real, and its name is because its snout is similar to a hammer. It is native to the African continent, with brown color in almost all its body, and its appearance can be terrifying for many. For this, they have called him the Jersey Devil. There is something about this bat that makes it really dangerous. The hammerhead bat is one of three African species of bats that are believed to carry the Ebola virus. The local human population has destroyed most of the habitat because they use the hammerhead bat for human consumption. Monkfish Extremely strange and curious creatures inhabit the sea, and the monkfish is one of them. This species of shark has a really ugly and terrifying appearance. But be aware, it is also a skilled predator that in an instant can attack and immobilize its prey. Monkfish use the ground to bury themselves, and from there they visualize their dinner. But near humans, it's rarely being aggressive. It will only cause a little painful bite since they usually are near the beaches and on the surface of the sea. Sadly, like with many species, humans have taken it upon themselves to destroy most of the monkfish population to serve it as an exquisite dish in the area. How many of these animals did you know or have seen on TV or the zoo? I bet a lot of them. It is very important to expand our knowledge about the different species with which we share the planet, because this way we will be able to understand our place as human beings in the world and the role that each of us and the role that each of these creatures fulfills in our planet. Unfortunately, many of these species have been brought to the brink of extinction for being so unique, being used as pets, food, or simple trophies. So remember to respect all the animals that exist no matter how strange they are, and take care of the environment in this way. These strange animals can continue to surprise us with their peculiarities. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you had fun, and see you next time. Remember to click the bell icon after you subscribe so you can get instant notifications of all of our new videos.